like a gift giving guide. Silent video. Well, I'm going on the highway, so. Hey guys, welcome back to Our Family Nest. So I'm putting some makeup on for the day. Not really sure why. Not going anywhere. Just been doing cleaning and things around the house. Answering some emails, which kind of silly to answer emails on the weekend, but I was so far behind on a lot of my emails and stuff. I decided to go ahead and get some work done so I'm not completely slammed tomorrow morning. I don't know guys, I am 47 and I'm really feeling pressure to get some Botox and stuff. I feel like there's quite a few YouTubers I watch and they're in their 30s and they're already getting Botox. I don't need it. Like I get lines and wrinkles under around my eyes when I smile, but like, I don't know. There's so many people. I don't really have wrinkles in my forehead. <laughs> I have some sunspots that I could go to a dermatologist and get rid of those. But I guess they don't bother me a whole ton because my hair covers them. Cause I obviously wear bangs or whatever. But man, it just seems like it's the thing to do. Like, I don't even really know what Botox I would get, but I just feel like everybody's doing it. I think it's weird that uh, a lot of people get it done. I don't even think they look like they need to. I don't know if maybe that's why, because they get like, they're proactive about it and they get Botox and stuff before their face really looks like they need it. I don't know, it's hard to get old these days. So I don't know, comment down below if any of you guys watching or in your like 30s, 40s, 50s, if you've ever had it done and does it hurt? Number one, it seems like most people that talk about it, they always act like it doesn't hurt, but does it hurt? And also how old were you when you got it done? Cause I almost feel like then once you're in your like 50s, like say 10 years from now, I'm 57, am I even gonna really want it? Like, I don't know. Okay, what, what age then is too old to get it done? It's just something I've just been thinking about today because I feel like, I don't know. I'm not gonna fix my hair today. This is what it is. So what did I ask you guys? I thought it would be a lot of fun and it feels like here lately, I don't know, things are sort of just not even really in the Christmas mood. We finally made decisions on what we're doing like Christmas day in terms of dinner and stuff like that. And, um, I don't know. I'm just not really in the Christmas mood with everything going on, but I just need to get in the Christmas mood. And I thought it would be kind of fun to put together like a gift giving guide. And I could do like one for like women shopping for their husbands. I could give ideas for women items that they could ask for for their husbands. I could do a team guide. My kids ask for plenty and they literally just come up with stuff just to ask for something. Um, Carly, I think, finally did a what I want for Christmas video for her channel. Should be going up um, this week. Anyways, let me know if you guys would like me to do kind of like a Christmas guide video. So guys, it is Carly. Welcome back. Right now I'm sitting at the kitchen table doing a really complicated homework thing. I have to find all these quotes, explain them, make like my own little book Snap thing. Your fingers. And it's been taking me forever. And I'm doing it with my partner, but it's kind of hard because when you're not together, it's kind of hard to do, but yeah. So we're about to go pick up some Chinese food. Whose air part, air, uh, air pods are these? Mm -hmm. Need to brush my teeth. Silent video. Just kidding. Shh. Hey guys, so. Shh. Silent video. Is 
<laughs> what did you just uh, say? I don't know. <laughs> hey guys, so today is Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, so it's Sunday today, and Chase is doing a whole bunch of laundry, and I am sitting here, and we are going to go to my dad's house soon, because we're going to decorate the Christmas tree, and um, eat some dinner, and um, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, I had to do homework the whole bunch. And on Friday, I went to the dentist, and I missed the math test. And I'm not even mad about it, because guess what? I'm really bad. I don't know any of the math on the test, because I was gone for a week in Hawaii. Brown's not going to be able to put this in. Okay, actually. <laughs> okay. So, Neil is my friend who graduated two years ago, and... He was good at wrestling, so he went to Penn, an Ivy League school, to wrestle, and he faced, today, they wrestled Penn State, which was like, which is like one of the best wrestling teams in the country, and Neil ended up facing the number one wrestler in the country, Mark Hall, and Neil didn't even really have that bad of a match, but he got teched, which, for his first ever, like starting debut for college is not even that bad so yeah because neil beat the starter like a week ago for pen and then so they gave him like the like the go they're like yep you can wrestle against penn state and yeah and it was a white out so it's like hard to like like do good because it's a lot of pressure and it's hard to wrestle at rec hall in general so i don't think he did that bad of a job and and we'll be watching him more as the year goes and my first meet is one day as you guys know because i mentioned it probably fifteen thousand times and yeah i'm gonna go to i'm gonna drive me and stephanie you know, because there's gonna stephanie? be snow. wait should we say no they don't care they so, do. okay whatever i don't care well me and stephanie are both dating wrestling boys that's all i'm gonna say grant okay so we're gonna make a tiktok right no. now we're, We're gonna, gonna do the dance. No, no, no. I miss my no. cocoa butter kisses. Ow. No. No, no, no. So. Uh, so, yeah. What are we gonna get? No, no. Fusion? No. Don't Ooh, do you want that? Yes, I do. I do. Well, so, we have to get something else for my dad. Something else for her. He doesn't like sushi. He doesn't like sushi. I'll ask him I'll when ask he him wants. I'll ask him when he wants. Are you gonna? Are you gonna? Peace, love, and pixie dust. No. Oh. Poop. Driving pretty slow. I don't want to hit the sticks. I'm distracted. Trust me, this is a 12 foot wide driveway. You shouldn't hit the sticks. But if I do, you know I'm not going to get my temps now tomorrow. Why? Because I still haven't done my sixth drive. Because Miss scheduled me on Sunday and then told me I couldn't do it because she overbooked. Huh. So, I take my test tomorrow and I won't get my temps for another week. Oh, she only drives on weekends? I, I don't know. Well, I'm going on the highway, so... It's, the difference is what you're doing and what you're getting is no really no different, so... What do you mean? You're driving with us just like you would if you had your temps. Yeah. But I wanted to be able to go into Ohio. Yeah, let's focus on the... Mm -hmm. Start breaking now. Oh, no. You're like going faster. And guess what I'm gonna say right now. Slow down. Nope. Get off the white line. Get off the white line. Yep. Fine. See, look at how far away I am. All right. Well, stop here. This is my first time driving in this dark out. It's not really dark though. I'm staying off the white line though. You are. Take You're going to have several decisions to make here, so keep going. What do you mean? Are you going to make this light? You better, why are you slowing down? Once you get on the hill, right now, start brake. Brake, 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 brake. More. There you go. Good. Now accelerate. That was pretty good. I know. This person's turning. Oh, you got to get 
Always be checking the guy behind you too. I don't think he's chilling. I think he's driving. Okay, so me and Chase are at my dad's house. And? And this is Myers. <laughs> he's never seen himself on a camera. Only on the phone. So now he's in. Oh, he did. <laughs> yeah. There we go. We're watching Elf, which if you don't know what Elf is, it's a Christmas movie. Everyone knows who it is. Well, my friend didn't Everyone know what knows. it was. So, yeah. We had some sushi and my dad had some Burger King. Smiles, smiles. So we can watch Elf in the living room on the big TV. So you guys are never going to be able to guess what time it is. It is 12.15 at night and I'm up getting my video done for tomorrow because I won't have time to finish it up in the morning because we have cleaning coming because it's Monday. So Monday mornings are always super busy. But look what else is going on. What class is this for? English. I finally finished and I was unique and I used thread to tie the holes. Is this a big part of your grade? Yes, it is. This is like our test. So, why did you wait until the last second? I did not, actually. You didn't? You've been no. working on it? Pretty much, yes. Oh. On the way home from wherever we went, I was typing stuff. Oh. Uh, but it's hard because I didn't have my book. Right. And we got the entire Wednesday, or the entire Thursday and Friday to work on this in class, and we didn't get it done. So, no other option. So... Here's the cover. What's it say? How to change your community according to and that's a character and no, it's a author. Author of To Kill a Mockingbird. And here's all these quotes and explanations. That we have to do for hours. And you already have an A in English? I don't know. And then pictures. And then our names, so. <laughs> You've been working on this since like seven o'clock. Yeah. Five hours. <laughs> and then your dad got mad at you because you're supposed to empty the dishwasher. And what do you say? I said I'm never taking you driving anymore again. Because <laughs> you know why? Because if you didn't get the dishwasher done, he's gonna have to do it when he wakes up in the morning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So I was working on my to-do list. I have a lot of stuff I need to get done tomorrow. We actually got a lot of Ivy and Sage orders that came in over the weekend. So I need to send those out in the morning. And if you guys don't know, uh, we're still doing the Ivy and Sage orders. We're giving out the free um, chapstick keychain thingy. Go to our Instagram and follow Ivy and Sage if you want to see what they look like. We have a ton of patterns no matter if you spend five dollars or whatever you spend also you get free shipping if you spend a hundred dollars and almost everything is on sale so just go to our website and check it out be some great christmas ideas for sure especially if you're into like sweaters cardigans stuff like that so thanks guys for watching and we will see you in tomorrow's vlog carly has her driver's test tomorrow wish her luck mm -hmm.